hello guys it's your girl lucy welcome back to my youtube channel wow i'm back with another video um this is a part two of my last uh, video that was q and a so that was part one i'm back with part two so you guys i hope you're all doing good i'm fine i thank god for life for protection for everything so um before i continue kindly if you haven't subscribed kindly subscribe hit the subscribe word just click on it and don't forget to click on the notification bell so that every time i post you get notified <laughs> so guys let's do this i've written the questions down why there's something i need to say when someone is recording <laughs> i don't know what happens yani english gua inaenda in a bit inaenda so you guys i'll mix swahili english yekoyo kijerumani kwa hotekana let's get straight someone asked me what what questions should you never ask a woman is and this is something i've experienced um past few months weeks and all that i think i'll just say one thing which i find somehow sensitive I live alone age i'm not ashamed saying uh, how old i am um about age that's not that's not a thing i even don't understand why women lie every every year they are 20 or 16 i don't know why me i'm 29 that's it but this this one question um are you pregnant hey anyways no one should feel attacked um <laughs> i don't know what to say i've been asked this by my friends my i don't know who people even who don't know me blah 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 are you pregnant so number one the reason to why i'm saying never ask a woman such me i'll never ask a woman such my fellow woman sababu number one um maybe maybe the lady is just an aglow ama she's just added weight um because of various reasons or maybe the the lady was pregnant was carrying a baby and then things happened mtoto akatoka and maybe the woman lost a baby so that's one reason also some people when they have stress um they just wanna know na tu makanora you know um a lot of women go through you know the problem you know those problems of fertility blah 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 now coming and now when you ask a woman are you pregnant maybe she she has been trying and it's not work it has not been working so i think that's being insensitive yes shame on you shame on you never ask a woman if she's pregnant can you imagine maybe a woman just lost her baby and the answer what will that person answer you the, the feeling the or maybe that woman just uh, just tries over and over to get a baby and it never works over years i'm just saying it's not my situation but i'm just speaking for all other women out there don't ask a woman if she's pregnant don't so that's question number one. I have my Bible pen. We just tick, tick. Can you name it? Zoo. How are you and how are you coping with Corona? Thank you so much for asking. I'm very fine. Thank you. And I hope you're fine too. So I'm, I'm fine. Um, yeah, about Corona, we are just taking care. You know, kawaida too, wearing my mask, keeping distance, washing my hands, you know, sanitizing, um, yeah, such things. Ease of it, we all know. If it's not necessary, I'll not go to town and just Ivo Morando and all that. <laughs> What's all about your YouTube channel? Okay, let me just hold this. 
what's all about uh, your youtube channel which contents do you display yes <laughs> so my youtube channel is about um to say make like you i do cooking I, I don't have um a permanent niche that is for example i don't know makeups also so i do cooking makeups shopping hauls sometimes i do comedy uh, and now the, such videos like the one i'm doing now are they called a sit down videos where you just sit you're not showing in you're talking my youtube channel is all about that and then what's your three years plan from now oh my god my three years plan from now of course to you know my youtube channel i want it to be better i want it to grow yeah and you guys thank you so much for your continued support something son i really appreciate and i don't take it for granted i might not say this every time but you guys thank you so much so that's number one and of course grow you know career wise um do further studies um i have been wanting to you know to add one more thing to what i do but from a dental assistant you know just assisting the doctor fanya kitu extra like professional teeth cleaning and of course finish up my ama our started projects back at home 254 um yes we took ama hizo what else eh uh, and as a stroke personally personally to, to just continue being the good person i am i think i'm myself kujiamini eh kujiamini yeah just be better maybe you know continue helping you know sometimes we, we just don't display helping people which is not bad i'm not saying that whoever displays ama shows helping people blah 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 all i'm saying is just continue doing what i do um yeah be a better person love more you know life is uh, life is short that is yeah vitu kama hizo the next question is what do you hate what do you like wow should i start with hate let me start with the positive i like people who help each other i really love that yes that is number 1 number 2 people who are just um, themselves you don't pretend to be someone you are not that one uh what else i like um i like hard working people the reason why i'm saying this is nekoria dutoria nime toria nime means that's my mother tongue toria nime toria nime means there are people who just like sitting down and everything should be done for them they, they don't want to work <laughs> or iskia wapi <laughs> or iskia wapi hey it doesn't matter a man or a woman whoever i like i like do i even say i love i love or i like hard working people don't just sit there and wait to be served kila kitu well my friend what else do i like or love a lot of things but now kila kitu imesha evaporate hmm? yeah a lot of things by the way but at the moment i really don't know such such okay what i hate is how watu wakuja inbox not even inbox not only inbox yani mtu tu ameanza conversation without saying hello maybe we mtu we haven't even communicated for the last i don't know ndio we mtu tu amekuja tu sorry for that ame kuja tu inbox ameanza tu conversation say hello my friend how are you doing and then you can start whatever brought you to my inbox ama generally it's just you know courtesy i don't like people who say who command who just say something without uh, saying thank you please and such what else do i hate um people who guy maringo maringo my friend unaringia nani what guy hii maisha do you know unaweza toka hapa nje kwa stairs as you are walking uanguke tu uanguke uanguke ukufe cool down cool down my friend cool down my friend 
Sipendi watu wako na maringo. Unaringia nani? I really hate that. Guy, me I like down to earth people like if I have ever kama umewahi fikiria mimi ni wa maringo. I'm so sorry. Guy, me I'm really allergic to that. Maringo, hiyo pride, you know, pride, pride. Hi. Don't my friend, don't. Don't. It's just ni vibaya. It's very bad. What else? There, there, there's a lot of things. Size hata tusikumbuki. On to the next question. Wow. Now this one is huge, you guys. This one is huge. What do, where do I start? What? How different is life in Germany compared to Kenya? Like you guys are I had to even write vitu vitu mob utu tuote hapa mnaona I cannot even cover the whole you know I'll just I'll just mention kidogo kidogo maybe I'll not even you know go you know deeper and all that so the, uh, the difference is it's really ni inchi mbili tofauti totally different like totally different this one needs ni sip chai kidogo So I had to really I had to to write kiddo, you know to small whatever points and kindly don't come for me don't come for me I'm just saying um what I think you know compared to my to my motherland I'll never talk ill about my motherland but um, you know here in Germany there are negative and positive sides in Kenya the same way and all over the whole world so don't come for me and say oh mulimusikia ni muramu yuire araugire aka Kenya aga ma aga aga do aga sia thire sia we guy ni no kugadira uga ni kupitia so number one, the life is different when it comes to things like what we cap punctual pointless that now my problem is now uh, translating whatever i wrote here what we cap punctual keeping time oh my friend here in Germany keeping time is the first thing i had to learn like you have appointment at 10 it's at 10 my friend you either you are there 3 minutes earlier um or you are just punctual it's 10 you are there you are entering the office ama whatever yani being punctual huku yani keeping time here is one of the most important things yani ah home back at home ah guy oh Uh, okay hey what we home okay to let's work on that so anyways to endele mambo kama um driving license things like driving license my guy you have to you have to there's no chochoro there's no chochoro you have to go to a driving school like you have to Yaani ukue unajua hata kuendesha home you come here and say oh i know agado agado you have to go to school like lazima upitie the legal kuperatia it has to be on paper hmm? yeah at at home unajua unaweza enda kuonyesha huko kwa kijiji and then not if one like i said usitumie my my words and upindue au araugire atakia atakia um all i'm saying is back at home see kama sit it's like see kama lazima you, you know what i mean plus something else something very different it's it's about the cost wow driving license huku it's so expensive like oh my god what like kufanya the driving license itself it's more expensive than buying a car let me say so wow kwa sababu mine mine i think nilifanya na 2000 2000 euro 800 i think 2000 euro that's almost 300k that's driving license peke yake yeah to say home na i don't know around 20k you're good to go right i stand to be corrected kindly comment down below if i say something that is wrong kindly also correct me mambo ya police huku police ni watu wa do i say wako calm like huku hawagopi polisi yani wako ready kuonyesha kitu to help you hata kuja kushike mashati there is that oh, oh ana respect mtu kai what back at home wasi ninaeka chumvi am i exaggerating am i am i no 
Anyways, let, let's not even go there. Let's not go there. Anyways, something else. There is something called in German, Ruhezeit. Ruhezeit means peaceful moments. I'm a, mm, sorry. There is that time from I don't know what time to what time. Nothing like kukua, loud music. I don't know what. Blah, blah, blah. There's nothing like that. For example, Sunday. Every Sunday, it's a, it's a, like, God, how do I translate this? It's a, it's a peaceful day. You don't just go shouting and loud music. Something else. What time do we have? It sits. At 10, every evening, like, Gioni at 10 Pia Hapo If it's loud music It's either you have um, Reported to Our To a, a gado, You know And say Kwangu kutakuwa loud Blah 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 Ama you tell You alert the neighbors So that they don't call the police for you I don't know if you get Like from 10 Like kila siku Every day from 10 Then you have to Tell your neighbors Oh it will be loud Blah 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 Ah buri utaitiwa polisi So all I'm saying um, Yeah back at home There's nothing like yeah, okay, of course. I, I know. I think Kwanza what when you are co estates and such, I think there's something like that. Kitwamayo, whereby police wana zakuja. But it's not that strict kama huku. Kai, uku aki kai, hey, mi rules zingine za uku, wo zina ni choke. Ikifikia ni kwa barabara, there are, there, there's a way where pedestrians wana tembele ya hapo. There is a way where you know, bicycles, blah, blah. Yani, kila mtu na leni yake. Kila mtu. Hakuna kumix mix. Basi, kama pa meandikuwa bus, the leni meandikuwa bus, ukutue hapo ukiendeshi ya bicycle, ama ukutue hapo na gari yako kidrive yako, my friend. Okay, don't say I did not tell you. So, all I'm saying is, um, I think back at home, watu shuguliki sana. Ah, bora tu, ama, ay, kitu kama yu. Something else which I find really when it comes to there is a motor and ambulance my friend it's always ni mimi usikia sana kulia kwanza for example when I'm back at home you know vacation and all that unasikia tu gari imelia tu kuna jam tuseme ambulance ndiyo hiyo hakuna mtu hakuna mtu anayondokea hiyo acha tatu niseme kwa kiswahili Si lazima kila mtu waelewe. Hey, hakuna mtu anayondokea. And maybe huyo mtu kabisa needs attention ya hospitali, blah, blah, blah. Though I had sometimes watu wengine they just wana, wana like a siren on. Tuseme tu wana, just for, just for, ndiyo tu apite. You know, tu, ndiyo watu wamekawe apite. Kwa sabu the person ako inahari. Huku you don't, you don't do that. Hakuna mtu, hakuna gari ya moto itaika siren on ama ambulance on without a reason. Hey, hey iyo nayo guy. Iyo nayo utakula shida my friend. You don't do that huku. So all I'm saying is um, the difference is huku watu wana pay attention sana. Sana. Like you don't joke with such things. So barabara ikiwa hivi of course kuna wale they're driving this like tuseme it's this way and it has one, two, one, two, and one lane, hapa, all heading the same direction. How about you on his side? Lazima uende, you drive on your extreme left side, yeah? And then ui mwenye kukatikati, pia kidogo. So meaning, there is a place hapa katikati, na kuna ingine hapa. Ambao wako on your right, you have to drive on your extreme uh, right hand side, Meaning, kukwe kuna gari ya moto, zima moto, kukwe kuna ambulance ama hakuna. Like, that's a rule. Lazima ukwe umeacha space just in case of anything. In case of anything. Itakuja tu nyue. Unona? And I find that, I find that awesome. Yani, iyo ni awesome. Yeah. So, what, what other thing? If the speed is written 50 kilometer per hour, yeah. If it's 50, it's 50. If it's 30, it's 30. Otherwise, the, otherwise there are those cameras set on the sideways, and I don't know. Sometimes you will not just see them; they will just capture you. And 
Yeah, you will have to pay my friend. Okay, she kwa marakava. They will even take your driving license. Wana andika points. Una studio. Kama kuingia kwa red book. Vitu kama hizo. So all I'm saying is, um, that's the difference. Something else. Huku, kitu ikifanyiki ya mtu. Mostly, kama tuseme, um, what is it called? Accident. Huku ni lazima. It's a must. Usaidia uyo mtu. Like, Usi, woy, kwanza ukishikwa na camera, taking pictures and blah blah, not helping, not calling police, it's trying to, um, you know, to at least the first day, blah blah, evil, you know, huku lazima usaidia mtu, you have to. Hakuna time ya kuchikuwa camera kwanza, kwanza that one, woy, woy, utalipa, utalipa my friend. And I find it good, as in at least, um, you know, it's about life and death, or okay, sometimes the person is not that much injured but i think the rule itself it's such an important one kwa sababu hey utachukuaje camera you start filming no 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 so like you have to help you have to help and na kila mtu anajua hivyo kila mtu anajua hivyo wow that one was hey that one was too long that one you know how different is life in actually i haven't even um said all it's this is a whole topic. This is a whole topic. Would you rather be in Kenya or Germany? Sincerely speaking, east or west, home is the best. Yes, that means I'd rather be in 254. Huku, for me, huku ni kuzuri kusabia kazi. By the way, life is not easy as people think. Maybe people, what people see, huko social media, and I don't know, agado, agado, agado. I don't know. Maybe a lot of people interpret according to how wana kuona uko social media. Wana fikiria, oh, she has it all. Eh, maisha mega, aga do, aga e maju, aga e yurupu, aga e moremo. Oh, my friend. Beke go ire. Beke go ire, my friend. Hey, we, kai. Oh, we, 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 it's not bad. Modo urehera goreke enjoy ne. Kila mtu. Anyways, kila mtu na maisha yake. The way you want to portray life, but life is not easy. Huku. That's me saying that. Um, all I'm saying is, hey, like I said, there's that positive and negative side about my motherland, and there's that positive and negative side about Germany. I think that would be a topic on its own. But all I'm saying is, east or west home is the best. Mimi saizi ni kiambiwa. Anyways, unajua, yeah, I'd rather be home. It's not that I have experienced something bad, but it's about, it's about that maisha ma, that social life. Hege kenoki, hege kenoki, hoge koragu umoshi. Tika adura nyita, hege kenoki ho. Now we are going, we are going to that. Um, Kwasabu, someone asked, um, okay, let me, no, this one will be like, I'll just join, join it together. Um, what do you like most about Germany? Sincerely speaking, I like the system. By this, I mean, the, the, the system, wako, do I say straightforward? Wako, Mutaratara, sio kama kai hii sasa nitaongea mpaka na miguu na mikono like mofago mupangilio nitoranyitana by this i mean mm, kila kitu ke in order nwanyita sasa hapa nitaongea kikuyu uliote kunyita mane hake mwenye hata elewa sasa ajipange yani um, mpangilio wa mambo Tio menyo gode na mauduma ike na uguma niya na gado, na doe, na do. Yani, systemu, yani, diyo reiki uga. And then, by this I also mean, here there's a lot of, what I really don't like, woko, ita godo, bureaucracy. Yani woko, it's a lot of paperwork. Maro wakonza, when we come back from Kenya, from Kenya, holiday shio vacation shio shio the nake nake to kaga marwa makinyi da tarore tarore jaraita nagada 
yani kai mundu yu ategothira na kila siku yani akukosi ba angaurihe agado 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 ah ni majibu anogete kunoga anyways but the good thing and the reason for that the whole paperwork yani kuku kila kedo has to be dikano pranyita na written down yani ma agreement mashio and you know why because of vitu kama transparency that means less corruption yani si kitu ati akaka ere akaka to vitu kuambia na hivyo na mdomo and that's it like kuna eh that means si ati hakuna corruption ni kwa kwa corruption but now compared to you know anyways so the system um this is a big topic by the way this is a big one this is a large one if someone is interested in knowing more kindly comment down below but sorry it's 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 large it's huge who uh, what do you like most about kenya oh my god where do i start where do i start number one that that social life yani adu mena gikeno watu wako na furaha sio kama mna get watu wako na furaha yani watu wanasaidiana tuseme for example kuna mtu anaoa ndio wa mama wame wameshikana aga adu aga ki you know ugadikwe na kio dona tu haruna ki hiyo maisha ya kusaidiana i love that about my sitongelea country zingine about my own country i really love the social life what who you know who know the umirire mundu without without an appointment mo mirakani though you pass by blah blah evil koge idania fara you know that life agado go oku you don't just wezi tokelezia tu mtu evil without appointment they would they like okay ate no mwaka bere mundu githikwa mundu hey goku ko iyo ndu e goku ko iyo ndu muno what else my beautiful country yani giri ni memera wanyama eh mahiu eh yitu nature no wanyita furuli witonde furuli mudaka muno kikane wanyita yeah what else kelele mimi mimi i miss kelele kelele tau ni thoko kwa soko you know kwa kwa market I really love that life back at home like you know that social life it's loud oh music good vibes blah 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 oh my god i really miss that we we really miss that everyone else can say about that kwa sababu hii maisha ya hadu makirete ki kwanza christmas watu ni kama wamekufiwa yani watu hakuna mtu hakuna neighbor wako hata mimi hata kuna ma neighbor their neighbors hata tuongelesha nangi like huku kila mtu ni na maisha yake and that's why watu wengi ni wagonjwa kabisa huku as in ma depression na maudu maingi ma goma ah as in guys yo sio ngivi baya kuhusu hii inchi na inchi yangu i'm just saying vitu ninatamani vitu misa gana idoite death na idonye death you can try it na yeah the free life as in generally free life ni tuge huwa something is amiss the good food food back at home 254 yani food guy that's that's a major one like hey kwanza street food hizo samosa sijui ma smoky sausages my chemsha boil mahindi you know chemsha and the, the grilled one ama the roasted one mie miss mie miss home generally like mie miss generally kila kitu kila kibai bibi kila kitu everything everything kina pila it's so that we don't have them here we have them lakini kuna hiyo taste chukua kuna hiyo taste sio kama una guess nyama choma mara matubo metoe matagiro mahu shoro kwamo kio yani mana guterere jahi shafashi sasa nitakaut nini kile wasemi wa mwenyewe oh my god those are things that make us ya 
can be homesick in your ship. Sometimes ndio upate that jahi what not even jahi kuna kwa wapi. Upate tu sana kerere au uji and I can do back to drive. I don't know how many hours when they will be back to them. Nie miss home. Mimi ni guinu kan mimi ni kushoka. Anyways, yeah. Such things like let me tell you uende wapi uende wapi mungu wapi uende wapi nyumbani is the real thing is a west yeah do you ever plan on coming back to kenya the answer is yes in the near future yes maish loves kenya so much so we have that plan in the near future of course yaraka even we have to to be sure that we are secure this and this and this good certain when the always the answer kusema the gasho kama ushio how now you have to go to manyika favorite big youtuber in kenya guy should i mention one miss is mention mmoja i love the njugush and wakavinye i love them so 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 much um who is oh my god you guys just stop as in i don't know the big youtube in kenya ni wengi by the way but now sasa ndanza ku list i just admire them they inspire me kenjugush na wakavinye and tugi kababa like those are my favorite ones at the at the moment of course yeah upcoming youtuber myself <laughs> hey self self love fast my friend myself i'm not going i'm not being egoistic but myself da henan so anyways i think you guys what that is 7 minutes video ona go tete kwaiwe kogo i think i'll end it at that I just hope that I have answered your questions you guys and wow <laughs> now this marks the end of this video I hope you have enjoyed kindly give it a thumbs up thank you so much comment comment on what you think also I stand to be corrected if I've said madhogodhanio kindly write down below and tell me ha ne wa hena ni hapa umedanganya when uniambie at least correct me sort everything i've said maybe it's correct according to you anyways guys one thing i need to say before i go i have a lot of content lined up for you hey now now after this one You guys just stay tuned yeah kindly click on the notification bell so that you don't miss a thing now this one will be awesome oh my god i'm so excited god i'm so excited i'm really excited so anyways let me end it at that thank you so much guys for the continued support god bless you so much may he keep you safe he may he bless you for me thank you so much we meet in my next one Yeah, thank you so much. Bye. From me it's a goodbye. Adios. <laughs>